types of human teeth and their function. Teats are the organs, which are made for the mechanical breakdown of the food, which is very essential for further breaking down it into a much simpler forms which can be absorbed. So let's get ahead. At the first we will learn about the type of teeth. Usually the human teeth are of four types. First tecodont. It means that our teeth are found embedded in sockets in our jaws. It is clearly visible here. Now second type bunodont. It means that our teeth have the small irregularities on its top surfaces. Now the third type is dipiodont. Means that our teeth occur in two sets. First is known as the primary dentition or milk teeth. And second is known as the secondary dentition or adult teeth. Primary dentition includes set of 20 teeth among them in size as are 8. And canines are 4. No premolars are present. While only two molars are present in the primary dentition. Let's talk about the secondary dentition or the adult teeth. Also these are known as the permanent teeth. It includes 32 teeth in adults, which have 8 incisors, 4 canines, 8 premolars, and 12 molars, which together form two set of 16 teeth in adults, a total sum of 32 teeth. Heading towards the fourth type of teeth in humans, which is the heterodont. It means that different type of teeth are present to perform different functions. Like incisors for cutting, canines for tearing, premolars and molars for grinding. Now let's talk about the roots of teeth. In humans, in incisors and canines, in upper and lower jaws both, they have only one root. And for premolars the case is not same. They have two roots in upper jaw and only one root in lower jaw. Now if we talk about the molars they are more advanced than premolars. Each molar have three roots in upper jaw and two roots in lower jaw. Here we came to the last topic of today's video. Which is the regions of the teeth. Mainly tooth have three regions. First is crown. Second is neck. And third is root. These also be termed by the constituents they have. Like, first is enamel, second is dentine, and the third is pulp cavity. Now let's talk about the enamel. Enamel is made up of calcium phosphate. It acts as hard protective covering of the teeth which protects the dentine and inner blood and lymph vessels. It is produced by the ameloblast cells. It is also the hardest substance of the body, which is made up of up to 96% of inorganic materials. Now dentine. Dentine is present just below the enamel. It is the bony part of the teeth as it is the bony part, then its origin and also mesodermal. It is produced by the odontoblast cells. Now, the last region is the pulp cavity, which contains the nerves, blood and lymph vessels. Pulp cavity is also produced by odontoblast cells.